I'm three centimeters dilated. Surprise! <laughs> Y'all, my camera died while Josiah was receiving his ball, but let me tell you, I missed my own baby sprinkle. I feel like such an idiot because my friend told me that the thing was on Saturday, but I misread the message. I thought it said the 11th and it said 11-ish. And y'all, I feel like such an idiot, but we're on our way there now. I'm not even dressed for like this kind of occasion. I cried because she called me like, where are you? And y'all, I just feel like such an idiot. And I don't know. If you, if you blame it on mom brain, girl, do I have dyslexia? Because at this point, this, I'm I'm really sad. I ended up crying at the basketball game because I'm, I'm just emotional. Like, how did I miss it? It started at 11. It's already 1255. I'm not going to make it there until like 114, 115. I got all the kids with me, which was not, you know, what we Continue for four miles. Y'all, we are on our way there now. We made it, you guys, late, but we made it. The brick one? Don't use your arms, just use your feet. Okay. I want them to use. All right. You gotta put your back against my back. Wait. Okay, go ahead. Yay! Yay! We did it! Good job, high five. Oh, God. Good morning, you guys. Alicia, no. <laughs> um, <coughs> you hear that? I just took the kids to the doctor because Daniel has had a fever since last Thursday that has been coming on and off. And Josiah had a fever last week too, but his broke immediately. That's why we were able to go to his basketball game last week. I am just, uh, I don't know. I'm at my wits end with these kids having colds 
and I took them to the doctor this morning and she basically said that it was just the flu and that it should pass here within a few days but now my concern is that you know I'm about to be having a baby very soon here and I don't want to bring my baby home to two other children who are sick I know that sounds strange but having older children who can talk and communicate what's wrong with them benefits me because I can treat their symptoms but having a baby baby and that child potentially being like sick with a cold or something like that I don't know what's going on you know what I'm saying so I'd rather us clear this cold up while we can before I give birth because I just do not want to bring a baby home with other sick children Josiah had to get a chest x-ray done to make sure that he doesn't have any pneumonia or anything like that and I don't think that he does he just has a really nasty cough for now so that means we are on our way to Target to get some items the doctor suggests that I give him Tamiflu she also suggests that I give him vitamin C zinc and vitamin D so I'm gonna go get all of those things I already know that I have zinc at the house so I don't need zinc. I need Tamiflu, vitamin C, and vitamin D for them. For all the holistic mommies, I know y'all do coconut water and stuff like that. But my kids don't like coconut water. So I'm going to get them some prime or something to keep them hydrated. I'm also going to buy them new cups. Girl, I'm telling you the whole rundown. Let's just get to the store so we can get this stuff. So we can get these kids on the up and up. Because sick children is not my jam okay also let me tell y'all they are out of school today and i don't know if the school system hates parents working parents or what but i am so sick of these teachers being off of work teacher work day this that and the third listen use your pto time if you are a teacher use your i gotta use my pto time when i'm off so you need to use your pto time too y'all get too many teacher work days mental health day girl use your pto time because i'm sick of it i was talking to one of my friend one of my friends last night and she was saying in the month of february her kids went to school one monday if there are four mondays in the month of february and they only went to school one Monday because the parent, because the teachers had a teacher work day on all the other Mondays. Come on, y'all. We gotta, we gotta pull it together. I never remember having these many days out of school. This is absurd. Anyway, I'm done with my TED talk. Like I said before, let's get into Target, okay? Let me tell y'all why y'all can't take y'all kids nowhere. I saw these cute sets. Look at this shorts and a shirt. Look, isn't this cute? They talking about mom. Come on, you came in here for medicine. That's why you can't take these kids nowhere. Don't take them nowhere. Y'all, they even got the sunnies to match the fit. We love to see it. Oh, you can't tell me. You know what? I didn't come here for this. These kids, right. I came in here for medicine. Look I tried her. to tell her. See, always trying to ruin the vibe. Stop. Stop. Now they got the sunglasses to match. We love it. They were so good. Mm -hmm. I used she also said they need to take zinc, but I have a zinc at home. Uh, it's actually a pill, though. This might be better <laughs> for them. Yeah, let's get the vitamin D in the gummy. We can get the vitamin C in a gummy, too. <sighs> Do you guys want tangerine, pink lemonade, or super orange? Tangerine. Tangerine? Come on, tangerine is super orange. Tangerine. Pick one. Tangerine. I mean, tangerine. Tangerine. Okay. All right. Vitamin C. I tangerine mean, emergency. I do think they need like a multivitamin. This is kids' immunity. Um, Those used to be hit. <laughs> free ten dollar gift card when you buy forty dollars or more, and I'm definitely spending forty dollars on all this. Hey, little girl, don't open it. Okay, I'm considering getting these baskets for my drawers. My sock panty bra drawer is so chaotic and a mess. Ah, uh, sit down, mama. Sit down. Look at this. <laughs> Your head being coming off, and you standing up in the car. You just acting up. Okay, anyway. 
I think these baskets will fit in my drawers really well. What do y'all think? Like three or should I get like one for bras, one for peonies, and then one for socks? I don't know. Comment down below. <laughs> y'all hear just like talking about comment down below. Anyway, we'll try to do this together. <laughs> Hold on, sweetie. Battle pass and it's so safe. Okay, look, the cream ones aren't even on sale. They're still full price. But the black ones are on sale. Let me see. Yeah. The black ones are on sale. They're 20% off. And they have gray, too. Yeah, the gray, too, is 20% off. So, I don't know if we're going to get these. I still have some in Heaven's Room that I haven't used. So, let me try those out and see what dimensions I need. We can, we can do all that when we get home. Hold on. Look. Oh, hi guys. Oh, I'm all dressed. Good morning. Well, it might be afternoon now. No, it's 11.39. Today's Wednesday. Come on, sit down. Oh. Don't mind my daughter's crazy uh, hair. You ready? Yeah. Let me put your headband on so we can't see your crazy hair. Yeah, come on. I need to run to the bank and I also need to go. Well, I don't need to, but I want to try this place called Major Phillies. Me and my husband and his best friend try, try to, um, can I get my words out? We have tried this place last year, but y'all, the wait was over an hour, and I ended up meeting, anyway, as I was saying, we ended up meeting this, well, I ended up meeting this social media influencer on Facebook. His name is Jamel Spaulding. He goes by Yamo Bucko. That's his expression, that is his expression for good food. I don't know why I can't talk today. It's becoming very ghetto. Anyway. We went there last year. We waited like over an hour for our food. It never came. They were like really, really backed up. And I want to try it again because I have a craving for cheese sticks. So that's where we're going to go. But first, I need to go to the bank because I got to get this money order real bad. Whew. Uh -huh. You ready? Uh -huh. No. I hope the food is good because if it's not, I'm going to be so sad. Uh, let's go. Uh -huh. This is it. Yeah, this is it. Cheese fry. They had a cheese fry in there. You like cheese fry? Yeah. Oh, it's cute down here. An order and an order. An order is just one. You got it. I wish I had had two. Yeah, I thought you got two. Hi you guys, it's a Thursday. I feel like dirt. I have been feeling like this since Tuesday, like my head has been hurting. And I just can't get it to let up. I've been taking Tylenol, but like the Tylenol will work for a little while, I'll feel normal. And then here comes the headache again. Last night I didn't get any sleep whatsoever. So I just said, you know what? I'm gonna come to urgent care because I, I don't know what's going on. Josiah and Daniel. Oh my god, my nose is running. That is so disgusting. Um, Josiah and Daniel did have like symptoms of the flu, but their doctor didn't like test them for the flu because they were on the tail end. And I don't know if I have the flu, but I just know that my body doesn't hurt. It's just my head, like my neck and my head is killing me. Anyway, I'm going in here and hopefully they can give me something to give me some relief. But I am at the very end of my pregnancy, 38 weeks. So, girl, I don't know, but it's looking real bad. So anyway, let me go in here. Okay, I have the flu. My temperature was 101.2. So she's prescribing me Tamiflu, and that's it. Hopefully I get to feel them better soon because this is so trash. A long time no see, right? <laughs> Whew. 
Okay. <sighs> Today's March 13th. I'm 39 weeks and four days. I do have on a towel, by the way. And um, I'm three centimeters dilated. Surprise! <laughs> I went to the doctor on Monday, told my mom that I'm three centimeters dilated, and she changed her flight from Friday to today because she didn't want to miss the birth of her baby. So I just got out of the shower, and I'm about to do my hair because um, we have an ultrasound today. I have an ultrasound because my doctor said that I'm not measuring 39 weeks and he wants to check the fluid surrounding the baby and how big the baby's actually gonna be. No, seriously, I enjoy ultrasounds because I get to see my baby's face. I also want to I also want to show you guys some of the items that I got um, from this company called Fancy Homebody. Let me get a brush and some gel or something. By the way, if my skin looks parched, it's because it is. Okay. It is, okay. All I have is jam. That's all I got. I don't have anything strong, but this should do. Anyway, I bought this stuff from Fancy Homebody a while back, and I never... I intended to show you guys, I just never did, because... Jackie Ina. Y'all know who Jackie Ina is? If y'all don't, y'all been living under a rock. But our good sis Jackie Ina did a review on them months ago on her Instagram and recommended them. And I was like, oh, okay. I ain't never heard of them before. Plus, I've never bought anything from Skims and I don't plan on it. So, I figure why not so <sighs> Because we love to see it. By the way, I'm supposed to be getting a silk press today after 4 o'clock, so hopefully after this ultrasound, I can still get my hair done. I desperately need a trim, and I want to wear my hair straight for the birth of my baby and afterwards for a little while. I do plan on getting braids after the baby is born. We gonna silk press it up. Alright. I don't know what kind of bun this about to be, but y'all, that look a mess. <laughs> Uh oh. Okay, this show is rated PG. Okay, not R. Okay, this ain't uh, this ain't OnlyFans. This ain't um, this ain't Pornhub. Okay. Ah, oh, my towel. Someone is insisting on making this show rated R. <laughs> and this is my towel. I need to go get my mom any minute now. Yeah, I might be late, but let me show y'all this stuff that I got from Fancy Homebody. Okay, I'm not going to do a try on haul right now because my mom's playing lands in just a few minutes, but this is the top. It's so cute. I love this ribbed material, and I also love that it has buttons down the very front, functional buttons at that, so that when it's time for me to breastfeed my baby, I can just do 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 my will be out right um the pants on the other hand they're so super cute i put you guys this way because my bed isn't made and i don't feel like making it either okay but i love the pants they're super comfortable the material is very very soft and it has this embossed fancy homebody um embroidery or i don't know what you call this kind of piece of material but i love this accent piece i will say that the pants are very long can you see that I'm trying to hike my leg up. I am 5'3", okay? I like to say that I'm 5'5 five five with brown eyes, but the truth of the matter is, I am not. My eyes are very dark brown, and I am only 5'3". So these pants are super long, super duper long, but that's okay. It's still cute. And I have the pants high-waisted to cover my belly because I don't want my belly to be showing like this. This just looks absolutely ridiculous. Okay, don't do that. But anyway, I think the outfit is cute. The browns are not the exact same brown, but they're very close, so it doesn't really matter to me. And I like it. I think this is something I wear to the hospital or home from the hospital. And then I have one more set that I can show you. This is what the packaging comes in. If you didn't know, blue is my favorite color, okay? If you can't tell by the last video, I bought them blue pajamas and then, girl, blue is my favorite color. My sheets be blue. Just, my blue is my favorite color, all right? I decided I'm gonna move y'all anyway. Mm -hmm. Whew, Lord. Okay, the girl is up. Let me go get the girl and then we can, I can show you the other set. Good morning, how are you? You want to say good morning? Say good morning! Hi! She doesn't care. Alright. Who knows? Because I know how you are. Along with this blue shirt I got, I got, yes. Yes. I got these matching shorts. Aren't they so cute? Let me show you. 
All right, these are the shorts and the shirt. Y'all, I love this. I'm obsessed. I am so obsessed. Obviously, it's not gonna look like this because I have my, uh, my baby is still in the bun. My baby is still in the oven. Hold on, sweetie. Here we have it, the last set that I got. Same shirt and then shorts. I love this, you guys. Can you guys see? I hate this lighting. Okay, that should be much better. Oh yeah, that is much better. So yeah, I got the shorts in the matching shirt. I could get this in every color because this is so comfortable. This is gonna be my summertime fit, okay? Because don't nobody have time to be getting dressed and putting looks together, especially when you got four kids, okay? Three in, yeah, so. I think this is so cute. And this is what I was talking about, about that like embossed material. I don't even know that's if that's what you call it, but I love this. I love this. I think it's super cute. Mom. And if you like it too, you should shop Fancy Homebody. Not sponsored, but look at this. They're so beautiful. Ladies are so beautiful. And I love them. So shop Fancy Homebody if you guys haven't already. It's a black-owned company. I am in all support of black-owned businesses, period. <laughs> By the way, all of my sets are in a size medium, if you wanted to know. And I have plenty of stretch, Mom. like plenty of stretch. I could have gotten it in a size small, but I think it would have been a little too tight. Anyway, Mom. I need to go get my mom, so I'll see you guys later. Hi, Cole's here. Hello. Hey, honey. Hi, honey. Hi. <laughs> hey, girlfriend. Uh, girl, it's hot. Yeah, it's warm today, but it's going to be cold soon, I'm sure. Why right, you got that mom, big old winter coat on? Because I'm scared to get the flu again. I'm terrified. <laughs> what if I get sick again? You ain't gonna get sick. Hey, Pi. Hey, girlfriend. <laughs> How you doing? Hey, she looking at you like that. She like. What's wrong with your hair? <laughs> I like my hair. I don't care what y'all say. Uh, so I like my hair, honey. I got, I got to switch it up, honey. Blue hair? Yeah, honey. I wear it all. I don't discriminate. The black. I can't do black. I can't wear everything but black. Black made me look like a ghost. So, uh-uh. Nope. Nope. I'm gonna wear these colors, honey. If they make it in the color, I'm gonna put it in. <laughs> if they make it in the color. Mm -hmm. I see. Mm -hmm. I see you yep. wearing those colors. Yep. Mm -hmm. Alright. Mm -hmm. A Puerto Rican in true fashion. <laughs> 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 Say what your name is. Oh yeah, that fishy girl. She keep it on and popping. I'm really trying to get to know you better, girl. You ain't gotta act like a shy girl. Don't you this la la like I like it. Okay, that's how I got pregnant. <laughs> I'm just playing. <laughs> um, so I'm here. I just pulled up at my new hair lady to get my hair done. So we about to go from the bun. Y'all seen the bun this morning. Okay, it's about to be no more bun. This, no ma'am. We cannot go into labor like this. Now after I get my hair done, we're more than welcome to have a baby. But before then, it's a no. <laughs> By the way, I did have to go to the hospital this morning to get an ultrasound to see why my belly was so low and to see if there was enough fluid in there for baby. Did you just survey the baby's right now? Maybe it's hot. Oh, Fluid looks fine. Baby is now about six pounds, 11 ounces. So we're excited. We're on track. Everything is fine with baby. It was so nice to have my mom there. She recorded a little bit. So anyway, let me get in here because I'm just talking and I got an appointment and I'm trying to be late for my first appointment because first impressions are a lasting impression. Remember that. Don't forget it. Okay, Mr. Speedy, Speedy and your Mustang. 
making all that noise hi you guys i'm back my hair is done no more bun i'm in love period i'm in love i love my new hairstylist she is amazing i'm keeping her to myself i'm not telling y'all who i go to because <laughs> i don't want y'all to book her up yes i'm being selfish but child sometimes some things are just better left unsaid okay so anyway i'm on my way home now i thoroughly enjoyed my experience i was asleep at the shampoo bowl y'all like that's how comfortable the environment and the atmosphere was and i just thoroughly enjoyed my experience i do want to say that i want to take better care of my hair this year because i know i am lazy i know that i am so lazy when it comes to my hair and i'm so like put it in a bun whatever the case may be but i don't want to continue to do that i actually want to do better with my hair this year so i booked i've already booked an appointment for May, even though it's gonna be hot as I don't know what outside. I'm on my way home to see my babies. But y'all wanna have some car karaoke? Because I miss doing car karaoke since I've been sick and laid up on my dang old back. I ain't been going nowhere or doing nothing, but let's hit this car karaoke. Can we get them off? Thank, Thank you. you. We both saying they got taking credit too. <laughs> okay, I don't want to hurt you. Bit. Sesame crunch chopped salad kit with mandarin oranges. It should be good. Hello, all you cool cats and kittens. <laughs> <laughs> you have to get these from Trader Joe's. They're fire. That's for us, right? We don't share with those boys because they're not nice to us. Yeah, we're gonna try these. Strawberry lemon, that's a little sour, ain't it? Mm -hmm. and okay, let's see what else they got. Okay, hold on now. Mom. Here, hold that for mommy. Thanks, girl. We're leaving trade. Oh, he ain't about to get none of my money. <laughs> no. We're leaving trade to Joe's. What do you want to do? What else do you want to do? What? <laughs> Why are you looking at me like that? Y'all should have seen her face. Why? I said, what else do you want to do? You took on some. But why are you like? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, but whatever you want to do, I'm good. I have no plans. This is my plan. I ain't got no plan. Alright then. Then that's the plan. Uh, close the door. Good deal, fat mom. Girl, why your hands get so filthy? What you touch? Maybe she touched the car. Ugh, her hands nasty. No, no. Oh, you got your chips out. Bye. Right, let's do a little Trader Joe's haul. Why don't we? Just excuse the mess. Y'all know this house is lived in, alright? I got these beautiful flowers. Aren't they so lovely? They're so beautiful. I wonder why they have these straw things on the top of them, though. I've been having so many contractions, but they're not close enough. They'll be like 15, 30 minutes spot. They real far. So we ain't worried. Yes. Maybe I should put it in my Valentine's Day base. Because it's taller. I don't like that either. <laughs> okay. Alright. So I have to do in this base. They're cute enough, I guess. Trainers! My jam. I got some cheese because we're making macaroni and cheese for dinner tonight. Butter, three packs of chicken wings, uno, dos, tres. Green beans. We haven't had these in so long. These are the hash browns. 10 out of 10. We have them for breakfast in the morning with like a BLT. Yeah. Fruity bars. I've never had these before and I'm a little opposed to lemon because it's a little sour, but we're gonna work with it. My favorite 
Oh, these are so lovely. I get these every time I go. Right, first bag done. Popcorn for the boys. Some bananas. I haven't had bananas in so long. And they're really good in my smoothies in the morning. So, bananas. Two things of sweet taters because one is going to be for dinner tonight. And then the other one, you can make it with um, like avocado, which I didn't get this time. That was really good. I made that in a vlog. It was yum, yum, yum for my tum, tum, tum. <laughs> Got some apples. We love apples in this house. And I have yogurt for my smoothies in the morning. I'm having a contraction. And if you see something in my teeth, just ignore it. It's smoothie from earlier. Oh, Lord. All right, and then I got two things of milk because the girl still drinks milk. Ooh, I'm having a contraction. Real bad. And just like that, it went away. We love that. Can I call you, Rose? <laughs> All right, I'll see y'all later when I have something to talk about, but... Y'all see my hair? The girl, she did her big one. She did her big one. <laughs> Alright, bye y'all. Oh, hello. I hate to come to y'all like this, but I'm officially in labor. Oh, I'm having another contraction. Oh, 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 oh.